Hey guys, it's Alex Sosh1234 here from iPhoneExpert.com and you notice I said from iPhoneExpert.com because I completely redid my website. Make sure to go check it out for iPhone, Apple, technology news. We also have a growing forum and we're updating the news regularly whenever something comes out. We also have a ton of tutorials and a lot of resources that people like you guys watching my videos interested in technology would really like and have a lot of use from so make sure to go check that out register on the site and the forums and I'm sure it's gonna help you out a lot and you're gonna like it so make sure to send it to your friends and everything and the websites kind of a pre-release I'm gonna have an official video um, telling about it and showing it so stay updated for that so this video is going to show 10 and more awesome themes from Cydia that you can download it and use them from Winterboard. And if you don't know what Winterboard is, it you can use it to put themes, well not really put themes, but utilize themes and activate them on your iPhone or iPod Touch. And it's very simple to download a theme. Just go into Cydia and uh, find your theme and download it. So here are the 10 themes, 10 or more themes I'm going to show you. So the first theme is smooth. That's the one I have on here. You can see it activated. And you already saw it pretty much. It has some awesome icons. It's pretty simple and very well designed and that's why I really like it. And it has a nice gradient background and uh, some cool cool icons on the bottom too. And I really like this. It's one of my favorites. All of these are really great themes. That's why I'm showing them to you. So the next theme is called Apple Element. We're going to turn that one off and activate the Apple Element theme. So here is the Apple Element theme. You can see it has a nice wallpaper and a custom slider. So that's really cool and it has a little stars and element there. And then you have a very colorful theme with a pretty unique background, the apple and the colors. I really like it. It's pretty colorful, I mean, if you want to show it to show it off and say oh look at all the colors <laughs> but it's a pretty cool theme not that hard to design probably it's just uh, different icons and little images but yeah, I'm just showing you them so you can decide which ones you want to download from Cydia the next one is 8 Lias Tag I'm not sure how you pronounce that remember I'm just showing you these there could be other elements to the theme meaning they could have custom SMS well not on the 3.0 that's not up yet but they can have custom lock screens or uh, keyboards, stuff like that. But I'm not showing you that. This is kind of the basics, the icons and wallpaper. So this one, you have this little slider image. And you can see my clock up here is different because I'm using FontSwap, the application you can get from Cydia, and it works on 3.0 firmware now. So go check that out. And I have a video on that too, how to change your fonts. So slide over and you can see this one it's pretty sweet has some small icons and a nice background that looks like it's layered on top of like a bookshelf I guess and you can see my Tweety there <laughs> kinda stands out it doesn't have that many icons but it's pretty sweet it has that nice wallpaper and yeah I have a lot of emails that's cause in settings I put it on show 200 of each email so it's getting every one of my email from all my seven or eight accounts so I know you guys will comment and say that. So it's pretty sweet. I mean, it's not the most detailed, but it's pretty cool. I like it. So the next theme is the me oops, the metal things blue. Now this is an awesome theme. Now you can download any one of these from Cydia, and most of them are from the community sources. In the description, I'll have if they're not, but I think all of them are. And this one's really unique. It's gonna turn off. Okay, so here's the theme and you can see it has an awesome wallpaper and a custom slider and it changes up on the top changes to blue you can see the AT&T and the lock thing and the Wi-Fi makes it blue so it's pretty cool so let's slide it over and there you see the icons and my Tweety button I mean icon they don't have that so let's check it doesn't it just has the main icons but if you scroll to the back look at that awesome wallpaper it has it's a moving wallpaper let's zoom in there watch whoa whoa that's pretty sweet and it has some awesome bottom icons the main icons phone mail 
Safari and iPod. So this is the theme, and if you like it, go check it out. I like it, but it's up to you. The metal thing's blue, that's what it's called. Now let's turn the Alive theme on. Okay, so here is the Alive theme. Well, this is the lock screen. But this is a custom wallpaper I put on myself. It's actually available on the wallpaper section on my website. So go check that out if you want, and you can put it on your iPhone. So let's go to it, and here is the theme. It has very simple icons, but nicely designed icons and and squares with a cool outline and different colors. And you can see it has a Facebook one. What else? Google Earth. Um, Topple it has. It doesn't have that many, but I mean, you mostly have your main icons, the ones that they give you on the front screen. So let's go to the next theme. That was the Alive theme. Now let's go to the Black Chrome. Oops. Let's turn on the icons. Red. Let's turn them all on. Okay, so here is the theme. And you can see the custom slider and wallpaper. And there you see it. So it doesn't have any main icons. It has text as icons. And the wallpaper puts it in, into kind of a stylized, organized way. It's pretty sweet, but it's kind of hard. I wouldn't really use this one, but it's, some people might like it. Because I like the big icons. And you can see it has two things. So it says settings, settings, notes, notes. So it shows the thing two times, the text. And there you see it. It has a lot of icons, so it's like another plus. But I have so many apps. I think, I don't know how many pages, a bunch. But that's pretty sweet. So next theme, let's go to that. That was the black chrome theme. The Christmas lights. Now, this isn't a theme. This is more of a wallpaper. But it's still pretty cool. I mean, if you want to keep festive for Christmas. <laughs> But I still like it, and it's kind of fun to show off. So there you see it. It's very simple. It just has the main icons, no icons, actually. And you can see the moving wallpaper in the back. So that's mostly it. It's pretty cool. I mean, I don't know. I like it. It's just simple and fun to have. So next is the safety not guarantee theme. I'll have all the names in the description. Okay, so here is the safety not guaranteed theme. It has these cool icons and an awesome wallpaper that it comes with when you turn it on. And you can see that. And they're transparent, so that means when you add another wallpaper and put a different one on, it kind of looks like a brand new theme. So that's another plus for this one. And again, I'm not showing all the aspects of the theme. They might have different things that it comes with but I'm just showing the main aspect to it the icons and the wallpaper the next theme called Satine here it is and it has very small icons and they're pretty much uh, square circular kind of things they're pretty cool again I'm just showing you these I'm not saying they're the best but they're pretty cool ones that I found over time and you can see those and it mostly has the main ones right here. Oh, it's getting blurry. So there you see this one. That's the Satine theme. Now let's go to the Trauma theme. Okay, so here's the Trauma theme. And there you see it. This one's pretty sweet. And let's zoom in here. You can see that the icons have a really unique design that blend in with the wallpaper, which adds a really unique feel to it kind of like it's blending in you can't really like touch them or something because it's the wallpaper and I like it it doesn't have that many just the main ones which could be a problem but let's check it out if you like it in Cydia the next and last one is called time of day now this is a wallpaper not really a theme and what it does is depending on the time of day I'm guessing it's based on the clock it changes so let's see what it does so it's showing the time of day on the lock screen because we clicked that in winterboard and here and if you click on another theme and you have it at the top it means it will take over so I want to show this that winterboard is layered meaning that if I have this on it will show the trauma icons 
and there you see the trauma icon so again reassuring that winterboard is layered and that's why some of you guys have problems and you can see from the it says three right there meaning the Wi-Fi I'm sure that I'm pretty sure the trauma theme takes over the Wi-Fi and puts that in so this is the video showing those themes let um, me just we started at Smoog and we moved all the way up to the time of day so we covered a lot of awesome themes I hope you like this video make sure to comment rate and subscribe I really appreciate the five star rating help, helps me a lot and uh, make sure to check out iPhoneExpert.com a lot more videos coming up sorry I didn't make any for like a week or something but I hope you like this one and uh, thanks for watching see ya